Hey guys, uh, this is Alistair McLaren back again for another uh, video, but this is actually kind of a different kind of video what this is going to be. This is going to be sort of a support video for pro wrestlers. Uh, that's the reason why I'm wearing this Rated R Superstar t-shirt. This is why... I'm holding this mid-card Intercontinental Championship, uh, WWF WWE Intercontinental Championship. So, uh, yesterday in the States, uh, yesterday slash last night, the WWF WWE, uh, now they normally do this roundabout WrestleMania or after WrestleMania time. This is just to, uh, they do budget cuts basically. Uh, they cut straight across the board uh, from people in the front office, uh, producers slash agents, uh, WWF, WWE superstars, the whole shebang, okay? Uh, and what Vince McMahon did yesterday, he had a sort of like this, a conference call with everybody, everybody in the company saying what was happening, what was going on, what what's going to be the future projection for the WWF, WWE. And, uh, wow, uh, that's all I can say is wow, is I think out of their whole roster, that is developmental, uh, NXT, SmackDown, uh, Raw, the men, the girls, everybody. It was one big, massive cut right down the middle. Uh, you had uh, crowd favourites getting cut, like uh, Zack Ryder and Kurt Hawkins, uh, uh, former United States champion Rusev, uh, quite a lot of guys that were just coming up the ladder uh they even a uh, a uh, sat uh uh for a uh, former olympian 1996 olympian former wwf wwe champion for uh current uh hall of famer kurt angle uh he got cut they even cut a uh, referee slash a uh, agent by the name of Mike Yota. Now he has been with the company since 1989. Anybody uh, that's ever saw his matches, classic matches, he's refereed matches, like the main event for uh, WrestleMania 14 with Stone Cold Steve Austin, Shawn Michaels, many, many other matches. It was one of those names that you never thought would be sacked, basically. You thought somebody like him would be safe, but obviously that wasn't to be and they went right through their producers as well producers that have been there for a long long time uh for the likes of uh mike Corrup mike rotunda he is uh bray wyatt and bo dallas's dad uh he was earn our shikes or irs uh for uh old school uh, classic wwf fans he was tag team partners with the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase, they were Money Incorporated, great, great tag team in the 90s, uh, great heel tag team in the 90s. Uh, and I just want to say on this platform of what I'm doing is to all those wrestlers, all those producers, all those agents, all those uh, creative people uh, who entertain us, in the WWF, WWE, uh, I'm giving out the hand to you. Uh, I'm going to put this on all my social media platforms if I can. Uh, if you guys are feeling down, if you're feeling depressed, if anxiety is getting to you, just click and use me as an agony ant, you know. Uh, let it out, you know. I mean, I know times are hard. Uh what people need to remember, though, is it's not just WWF, WWE superstars that this is going to affect. 
uh, with C19. Uh, it's going to happen across the board when it comes to wrestling companies. Uh, all, all Elite uh, Wrestling is going to get hit by it. Uh, Ring of Honor is going to get hit by it. Impact Wrestling, though their roster's quite small as it is anyway, but they're going to get hit by it as well. Uh, many independent companies, in fact, a lot of companies over here in the UK will do it as well. Uh, and uh, Japan, New Japan, uh, they're going to do it as well. Just the unfortunate thing is for all the WWF, WWE superstars that would go international, and as far as I know, international flights are still grounded in the US, so the stars that think that they can go elsewhere, uh, like Japan or UK or Europe, uh, they can't go anywhere. They're stuck at the moment. Uh, so they're going to have to try and find uh, another way of income at the moment. So the reason why I'm holding this mid-card Intercontinental Championship uh, in this video is this belt, if you're a wrestling fan, will understand what it means. This is class as the workhorse belt uh, in the WWE. This is like the talent belt to have. Now, this has had many incantations, designs, different, des uh, different designs, but everybody, when they see Intercontinental Champion, they know what this means. Uh, so this is for all everybody that lost their jobs yesterday the workhorses behind the scenes in front of the camera behind the scenes all of it this belt is for you guys this represents all of you okay so stay strong i know times are hard i'm a key worker myself as i've said in previous videos i'm on leave at the moment and believe me best thing I've done because I'm on leave at the moment getting my, the right mindset so when I go back to work I'll be refreshed and I'll be set to go again you know so it's what to do is take some time out get yourself recomp recompose yourselves and go back into the world and go FUC19 FU2020 I'm taking you on Best way to look at it, guys. Stay pos positive. Please stay positive. Uh, and also, because this is uh, NHS Thursday, what I'm also going to do as well is anybody that recognises this belt, this is the WWF WWE Attitude Era Women's Championship. Now, what this is, what I'm going to do with this, this is a tribute to every female, lady, woman, all of you uh, that work for the NHS, this belt is dedicated to you. You are amazing. Okay, my wife is a key work works for the NHS herself, a key worker, and so do many of our friends. And I applaud you. You are then doing a marvellous job. So I give this belt as a tribute to all of you NHS ladies. You are my women champions. All of you. Please stay safe. Okay. Please stay safe. Look after each other. And let's get through the C19 as best we can so that's it for now guys again to all the WWF WWE superstars agents referees everybody that lost their jobs yesterday if you feel like using me as an agony aunt I know that is probably a big ask you probably don't know me you won't know me for Adam but if you feel really down please take the hand click here on my name and come and talk to me if you need an agony ant to let it all out on. That's what I've made these videos for. That's what I'm here for. Uh, so, in closing, 
stay safe everyone and uh, take care